Alright, so replace this coil on this geothermal heat pump. Place the TXV in the filter dryer, biflow filter dryer. Pulled it down, vacuum below 500 microns. So, about to start charging. So, let me take this, uh, this off real quick. Make sure these are shut. Don't want to start over. Take that off. Trader core back in here. So, gonna hook our free on up. Track down. Flip her over and open this up. And then you always want to purge so you get liquid right here. That's good. Alright. So you want to dump. This thing takes. <coughs> Seven pounds. <coughs> <coughs> so I'm going to dump four on the high side of the compressor. If you dump it on the low side, um, the compressor usually locks up and won't start. So it's kind of common HVAC trick. Uh, practice to dump, uh, I'm going to dump probably four pounds on the high side and then we'll start it up in cooling with the heat pump. You definitely want to start with cooling, get your charge right and uh, then we'll swap it over to heat. Stop at about fourteen six. I got my probe ready to get my readings on my suction line. About another pound, I'm gonna run upstairs and turn the cooling on. That'll work there. Shut her down. Put this door on real quick. Hold on just a second. Let's plug this in and see if it'll fire up. I got it in cooling, but it's kind of a cool day. Alright, my pumps came on. I'm going to go upstairs and check the thermostat real quick.
unit is running. So we got four pounds out of the total of seven. 42 degrees coming up pretty quick. Let's let it stabilize. See suction pressure's real low. Air pressure's real low. So uh, get some in there. So you just want to give a little burst to the suction side. Good, let it swoosh around in there for a while. So we're at 58 degrees there. Zero degree saturation. Dump a little more in there. another two pounds to put in there. Go ahead and finish it off here. Alright, all seven pounds are in. It's a really cold day, so. Still winter time. This uh, suction pressure is going to be low. That's it.